Okay, we have a semicircle and the radius is the uh, 5. So I'm going to label OA5. And then X is in degrees. And they say the arc length is 3 pi. So from here to here, that's actually 3 pi. There are uh, different ways to do this. Um, you have a radian way of doing it. Let's call that arc length S. So let's call this S is equal to radius times theta if we're talking about radians. Okay. And then you could convert it back into degrees because this is in degrees. Or you could do everything in degree form. Okay. Let me just do it in radians form. Let me make this a little bit smaller. Okay. If you do it in radians form, the arc length is 3 pi. Set it equal to radius, which is 5, times the theta in terms of radians. Just divide it by 5. So theta will be 3 pi over 5. As simple as that. But then the uh, you have to convert it back into degree form. So you have to multiply pi on the bottom, 180 degrees on top. So pi's cancel. Let's see, 5 goes into 180 3 here, uh, 6 here, and then that gets converted to mode. So 3 times 36 is the 108. Okay, so it's 108. However, if you wanna, if you don't like the radiance, you could just uh, focus on degree form. Oh, let me erase the top here. Let's uh, do it in degree form then. So we know the circumference of a circle is 2 pi r. That's what the uh, formula for circumference. Now, the whole circumference, do we want the whole circumference? Nope. We just want, we just want, so let's say 3 pi is this, this portion of the whole circumference, which is, which is x over 360, because x is a part here, out of the whole is 360 degrees, right? So 2 pi r, so this is what the whole circumference of the circle would be, but we don't want the whole thing. We want x part over 360 whole part. Okay. And then set that equal to 3 pi because this is 3 pi. So pi is cancel. Let's plug in what we know. Let's see. So 3 is equal to 2 times radius is uh, 5. So that becomes 10. So x degree over 360. Now this, since this is 10, 10 cancels with uh, one of the zeros here. So, and then multiply by 36 on both sides. We're going to get the same thing. So, x will equal to 108 degrees.